Hey guys, it's Robin with WomenWithRobin.com. So back to um, overcoming procrastination. Step one was to figure out what exactly the reason is that you're procrastinating while you're prolonging doing something, right? So step two is going to be to set micro goals, set smaller goals. If you break it down, um, like if you break out, break down whatever it is that you're trying to accomplish down into smaller goals, goals then it seems more obtainable and doesn't you don't get overwhelmed so much with it. So let's say you're wanting to get 10 leads a day, okay? Let's say um, you want to get 10 leads a day. So if you don't think of it as, oh, I got to get 10 leads today because then you'll get overwhelmed by the number and achieving the go. So if you think of it as, okay, let me get, I need to get, you know, three leads by noon, another three leads by this time. Once you get those, once you get those three leads, this, once you reach the first go, you're able to believe, like your belief comes even more because you reached your first, first go. So when you break the goals down and you hit a certain level, then you're able to get more power, more energy, more enthusiasm to go to reach the rest of the go. Okay, so that's going to be step two is to set micro goals, set small goals within your go to be able to take the time to celebrate the fact that you are reaching those goals. Okay, it, it kind of does a little bit of trick on your mind and then it also allows you to understand that you, you got this and that you can do what you're, you know, you can actually do it. So therefore, it helps you overcome the procrastination. Okay, so I have a free training for you. Go ahead and click the link in the description and I'll see you next time. Have a good day.